everybody, this is AutoTap Pro. Today we installed in 2021 Dodge Ram. We just replaced the original radio with our newest version of the Tesla system, okay? It's very nice. It's fully compatible with all the original features. Let's check it out. Hi everybody. So as you can see, we already um, fully installed the complete installation of the 2021 Dodge Ram, okay? The original car come with um, the 8 inch screen as you can see this is the original panel right here so this one is the original system all right you come with the automatic climate control and uh, the 8 inch screen you know and uh, we just replace it with our power system right here it's uh, come with the uh, 11 inches high definition screen it's very nice and it's fully compatible with all the original features you come with 12 inches okay as you can see the diagonal is 12 inches high definition screen is 1080p as you can see um, it's also fully compatible with the original uh, backup camera uh, original steering wheel control you can also fully compatible with the uh, uh, original sound system as well and the temperature right so all the tow hole all the traction control it will be maintained the same as you can see FPP is going to be right here FPP is going to be fully compatible as you can see you can also turn it on turn it off okay so and also the backup cameras right here you also come with the uh, traction guide 9 okay you, you will also turn the wheel okay so it's very nice and it's very clear too as you can see and uh, this one also fully compatible with the built-in navigation okay this one is the navigation right here the navigation is off now you do not need to connect to any wi-fi to use the gps how to use the navigation you just need to click on the bottom right corner here and then new road address and then you can enter the address right over there okay it's very straightforward you do not need to connect to any wi-fi to use the gps it also comes with the traffic update as well so um it's very user friendly right and other than that, so you can also, I'm going to exit the navigation and show you some other feature, right? And this one also fully compatible with the touch screen temperature, right? So you can also fully uh, use the touch screen to control the temperature as well. For example, you can also, you can see that this one is the new version of the touch button, okay? It's the sense button, okay? It's not a physical button that you need to press the button. So it's the newest generation for this unit, all right? So you can see that you can also use this one it's very sensitive and then you can also use this one to for the windshield bore and you can AC you know and the temperature also support the dual climate control okay if you have the uh, this the circulation right here if your car come with the steering wheel heating seat you will also support it all right you also support the um, heat seat original heat seat cooling seat this car come with the cooling seat and heat seat it's fully compatible with here okay you can also use this one to control it all right, so the radio is right here. As you can see, this is the radio. You can also use the steering wheel control to control the uh, to control the radio manual. Okay, it's very nice. In order to adjust the sound quality, you can go to console. I'm gonna show you. You can also adjust the bass right here. Go to here setting, and then it will support all the original features you can see right it's very nice this system is fully compatible with all the original feature if your car come with the auxiliary then you can also uh, fully compatible with the auxiliary mode here AUX12345 is fully compatible this is the original amplifier setting you can change the fader balance and bass travel you know and uh, surround sound actually it's very nice all right this is the emergency button for sure i don't need to explain to you this is for for sure it will be fully compatible you know and this one also come with the video in motion so you can uh watch the video on the road okay so basically you can just click on here evolutionary change bulletproof superhuman in order to use the video in motion you can download the movie to the usb and then you can also play that on the system as well this is also fully compatible with a couple of the application you can download any of the application to the system as well for example you can also use the netflix you can watch the movie right here okay so it's very nice all right 
you will also support the uh, Prime Video and uh, anything, you know, so you can uh, download the Watcher TV, IP TV, you know, and uh, this one, we will also preload some of certain kind of application for your latest Spotify ways, you know, so of course you can also log into your Google account and then you can download the uh, any application from that one as well, okay? So it's very straightforward and this is some also come with the wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. I'm gonna show you how to use the wireless Android Auto, all right? So basically, in order to use the wireless Android Auto, you will need to have a cell phone. Before we start, I'm gonna show you first, okay? So in order to use the wireless Android, uh, 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 wireless Apple CarPlay, you will need to pair the Bluetooth first. Once you get paired, you will switch to the Wi-Fi at the back one. So basically, you just need to go to setting, Bluetooth, Turn on Bluetooth of your phone and then connect the unit right here. Zero, 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 four, four, uh, four, zero. Once you connect to the Bluetooth, you see there's a Bluetooth icon right over there, and then you can just go to ceiling. Just keep that in mind wireless Apple CarPlay, they use Wi Fi instead of Bluetooth. Once you connect to the Bluetooth, you will automatically switch to the Wi-Fi at the back one, all right? And then you will also need to grant the authorization on the cell phone. For the first time, you might take a while, and then you will see the message on the cell phone, and then click Use CarPlay, and then go back to the original screen. Okay, as you can see, this is the wireless Apple CarPlay. It's very smooth, okay? You can uh, also, you also support the split screen here, okay? So it's very uh, user friendly. Okay, you will also connect to your cell phone. You can also chat all the message right here. Like the uh, message right here. If you have the WhatsApp, you can also chat the WhatsApp here. You also come with the voice control. Uh, how to use the voice control? Just hold the bottom left corner for a couple seconds. Bring me to the gas station. One possibility I see is SO on Kennedy Road. Perfect. Is that the one you're looking for? What's the temperature today? The high temperature for today will be 16 degrees and the low will be 12. Alright, so you can see, very nice, right? So you will also support the newest version of the iOS 15. Of course, this system also uh, support the wireless uh, Android Auto. So you can uh, also support the Android Auto if you have, a, uh, if you have an Android phone. So uh, you don't need to worry about that one, alright? One more thing I would like to mention is uh, how to disconnect the wireless Apple CarPlay. For example, you're, now, uh, you, you're connecting to the wireless Apple CarPlay of the iPhone, right? This is the wireless Apple CarPlay. And however, you want to turn on the Wi-Fi hotspot now because while you use the wireless Apple CarPlay, you cannot use the Wi-Fi hotspot to watch the YouTube at the same time. So if you want to check the email, maybe you need to share the Wi-Fi hotspot, then you need to turn off the CarPlay first. How to do that, just go to your cell phone, all right? And then search, go to setting, search CarPlay. Okay, right here is the first one here. So as you can see, so you can click on this one. Turn off this one, all right? If you decide to connect the CarPlay back to the unit after you finish using the uh, Wi-Fi hotspot, then you can just turn off. Otherwise, you can forget this car, okay? So um, you can just uh, turn off this one, as you can see, and then it's already off. And then you can turn on the Wi-Fi hotspot on the cell phone, and then you can connect to the unit. It's very straightforward, okay? And, and uh, another thing is that uh, you can also use the uh, steering wheel control to pick up the phone call, okay? You can also use this one. You can use this one to pick up the phone call. Once you pair the Bluetooth, then you can use this one. Everything is fully compatible, okay? So, and then you can, uh, once in a while, you can also use the double square side at the upper right corner to close all the application, all right? Actually, as you can see, one last thing, I want to show you the, how it fit on the original dash. It's very nice, and there's no gap here that you can see. It's very, I'm not sure if you guys can see that, because it's a little bit dark. Uh, but you can see it's fully flush to the original bezel. So it's very nice. Okay. This one can also be purchased from my website www.autotapro.com. If you guys have any question about the system, please contact us Autotapro. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.